Spring run salmon are ideal filming subjects. Spring run salmon swim far up the creeks to high elevations in the spring. They hold over the summer in deep, cool pools and spawn in late summer or early fall. The following film segment follows a group of spring run salmon from their entry into the creeks in March to their spawning in October. They share the creek with steelhead trout, native minnows, and a very nosy but well camouflaged western pond turtle. Early in the spring, the arriving fish are silver and sleek. They hold in the pools all summer without eating. Their bodies are changing to prepare for spawning. As the summer progresses, the salmon have put all their energy into egg and sperm production. They change from a silver to a dark brown color and get thinner as the summer progresses. The male salmon develops hooked snouts with exposed teeth in preparation for fights over females and nest sites. Biologists call salmon nest reds, and the males will frequently fight over which male gets to spawn with a female. Female salmon dig the reds with their tails. This gives female fish a raw, worn out tail fin. After spawning, all Pacific salmon die. Females will guard the red for a short period, and then with their energy exhausted, they die alongside with the males. Coleman National Fish Hatchery, located on Battle Creek near Anderson, California, is another great location for filming adults during the fall run salmon spawning period in September and October. The water is clear and the large fall run salmon are sometimes so thick in the creek that all kids should visit just so they can be like their grandparents and someday be able to say, why when I was a kid you could walk across the creek on the backs of all the salmon we had then.
closer the spawning salmon get, the bigger and sharper their teeth get. During filming I was glad that salmon stop eating after leaving the ocean. They don't eat food, but that doesn't stop them from biting at other fish or animals that may be a threat to themselves or their nests. This is why people fishing in the river can catch salmon on fishing rods using lures. This next part gives you some idea of how big salmon are compared to people. It was filmed at the Red Bluff Diversion Dam. The dam is open for salmon viewing from May 15th to September 15th of each year.